What's going on, everybody? This is Pavel Spartan here, and welcome back to Horizon Zero Dawn. Uh, in the last episode, we helped Emerid find his sister, which she ended up dying in his arms. Very sad, very sad. Um, but on a brighter side, there is no brighter side. Uh, Meridian's getting attacked, and we need to talk to the prince in order to stop it from being attacked and possibly save it. But this is going to be a fucking war. So, sit down, grab your popcorn, and let's get straight into this, because this is going to be one hell of a fucking fight. So, we're just rushing up right now to go talk to the people we need to talk to. Rushing straight up to that Sun King, saying, hey, listen, motherfucker. I've sent a messenger to the clan to let everyone know. We need to talk. If I'm glad you're back. I'm at a loss about her son. To learn she lives, then lose that hope, seems cruel. She wouldn't want us to waste time talking. She'd want us to find Durval. She said he raved about smoke darkening the sun. Tell him what you found in his papers. A letter. It mentioned a shipment of Blaze being sent to a warehouse here. Only, it wasn't addressed to Duval. The name was Ayland Forgeman. Does that mean anything to you? Uh, huh. Sounds familiar. Yes, a landlord. Okay. The Osaram have been buying up buildings across the city, including one under that name. Let me think. It's by the edge of the mesa, near the temple. It used to be a shop, but it could serve as a warehouse. If Durval used the name as an alias to buy it, he might even be there now. I'll round up my men. I'll meet you there. Errand, wait. Remember that no one hates Durval more than your own tribe. The clans would give up much to obtain him. Take him alive? So you can haggle over him? You can't be serious! Our security depends on keeping the peace. If the opportunity presents itself, take him alive. Consider that a command. <clears throat> Aloy, a moment, please. When we spoke, Aaron didn't wish to dwell on the details of Ursa's death. Understandable, of course. Mm -hmm. But now that they've been left to my imagination, those details are all I can think about. Yeah, kinda. You were there. Did she suffer? Ooh, what to say, what to say. I don't want to be rude and say this isn't the time. I... Ah. She wasn't worried about her pain. She was worried about her brother. And she was worried about you. Thank you, Aloy. Okay. I suppose I needed to know I was as much on her mind as she is on mine. Find Durval and bring him before me. He will answer for his crimes. Okay, so let's go capture this fuck. How? All I have are killing weapons. Bring me to Zion Warehouse. Stop leading me around in damn circles. Is this the warehouse? This looks like this is to the, be the warehouse. Yep. You home, Durbo? I got a surprise for you. It's gas. It's a bomb. Or he has a surprise for us. Is it a bomb? Doesn't look too big. Big enough to kill us. All right. I'll shut up. All right. Blaze. It must be leaking from something upstairs. Okay, so it's leaking from upstairs. If I try to take it apart, a booby trap will set it off. Alright. Uh, search the warehouse. Got it. Only place I can go right now is up. Oh, great. More blaze. If that bomb goes off, 
the blaze will ignite in a firestorm. That's a lot of blaze. If that bomb downstairs goes off, it'll be just what Derval promised. Smoke will darken the sun as the city goes up in flames. There's, there's got to be a way to stop it. All right, so what do we do now? Oh. Is there something I need to examine there? Maybe there there's is. some way I can open this window to get rid of the fuel for the bomb. It looks like a wooden bracket. Not very strong. Okay. Let's push this shit out of here. Help me push this out. Okay. Brute force. I'm good at that. What'll it do? Save the city, I hope. But when the blaze falls, run for it. Because the booby trap on the bomb downstairs is gonna get set off. Uh, will we survive? Probably not. Now push. Ugh. Probably not. Now push. And boom. We did it! Durval's best shot, and Meridian's still standing. That's probably not his best Durval shot. Said he'd make a VOD watch. No way. To do that, he'd have to get into the palace. Now that's too heavily guarded. Get back there, just to be sure. I'm gonna look around. Maybe Durval's men left something behind when they planted that bomb. I got it. Don't worry. He tries for the palace. He's finished. Alright. Huh. Let's see. Burning building. What is there to investigate? An escape route somehow, maybe? Okay. Boot tracks. With just a bit of blaze Press in them. R1. Tag someone. Oh, wait, trigger. Oh, I know. Avash. Da 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 da. Bring sand, bring water. Can I interest you in a reasonable Hurry share up. of a lucrative Get to the fire and shut up a bucket line? These aren't good. Necessities. What happened? I haven't heard a blast like that Out of my way, there's people no. in trouble. A colorful discussion. There's smoke rising from the edge of the mesa. Are we under attack? The tracks lead inside. Another one of Durval's hideouts. Has to be a reason he came in here. Down. Yep. This must be where Durval assembled the detonator. Durval did find a way into the palace. All right, buddy. Looks like you are, uh, Vault Devolved back to his place. How do I follow him back to his place? Let me find that trail again. Why can't I follow the trail? Unless it's along here. Oh, shit. There he is. <laughs> Should be able. I'm not exiting shit. Oh, okay. 
Okay. Okay. Basically just getting where he was. Yup. Wish I could be there. Tavalo, buddy, oh pal. I know you're in here. Show yourself, you little fucking coward. Ah, so this is how he plans to make the uh, Sun King watch. Look at you, Avad. The wriggling runt of a maniac king. You robbed me of my right to kill your father, so I'll have to settle for you. I'm going to enjoy watching the Karja burn, even more because you'll be watching with me. Say goodbye to Meridian, Avad. Breathe in the stench, and choke on the ashes. Something's wrong. Didn't I, I didn't hear anything. There's a bit of smoke rising from the mesa's edge. No! It should be a firestorm, not some belt from a charcoal burner. Alright, let's just take that out. Search the supply crate. Forget about traveling light. Are you okay? Alright. I'll come back to you. What's this? Oh. You must be the Nora who bushwhacked my camp. And disabled your bomb. Did you now? Well, bomb or no bomb, I'm gonna splatter that throne with blood. First yours, then Avad's. Alright. We'll see. Oh, is that a rope caster? That's cute. Attack. I'm looking right at you. Over yet, wench. Why does a bard always have his ladies do the fighting? Okay, what the hell is that weapon? Better than that, red. Holy hell! Kill kestrels and ravagers. A savage is nothing. Alright, he's down. Time to deal with his freaking stupid ass minions. Done! It's not over yet, Nora. Any good Osaram Tinker will tell you. Always have a third plan. Glidhawks. Uh, Holy hell! These things, because there's more in the way. It's a freaking frack ton of Glen Hawks. Never do the work if you can get a machine to do it for you. Alright, good. Keep it down, keep it down, and one, and crit, and two, and dead. Alright, one done. Next. Get down here, buddy. One, and crit, and two, and you should be dead.
collect all of the resources from the Glint Hawks. Snatch all of these. Holy shit. Hi, buddy. One and two. And come here. You. Nope. Okay, so you need a third. Get over here, bitch. And down. Come on. Crit. Got him. There's one. Come on. There's two. Get down here. Oh, fuck. Get stuck. I hate when they get stuck. Come on, fly over towards me. Come on. I was gonna say, get taken down where I can at least get to you. Beat the shit out of your ass. Alright, so I got two more to go. By the looks of it, just one. But I know it's two. One shot and two shot. Alright, get down here. Come on, buddy. Come on. Don't need to be frozen right now. Come on, one more. And come on. There we go. And he's down. He's off the edge. Alright. Alright, buddy. Plan three failed. You got another plan? As much as I wish Ursa was here to kill you, I don't mind doing it for her. Go ahead. I'm not afraid. Except that knowing you, Eren, you'll screw it up! I know what you are afraid of. Going back to Mainspring in chains. Every clan in the claim wants you dead. And they know how to make it hurt. They'll even bid for the privilege. It's just like you to get someone else to do your killing. Shut up. You're at the Sun King's mercy now. All right, so we got him. He's done. You don't have to worry about him, hopefully, ever again. That's great. Oh, we gotta talk to three people now. Oh, and one of them's optional? Well, which one's the optional one? Okay, of course the optional one's all the way at the very bottom. So we're gonna go do the optional one first. Because I do kind of want to talk to him. But first, I'll talk to this guy. Aloy. I was just thinking about Ursa. She would have killed Durval on the spot. I know it. That's why she went out to meet him in the first place. To put him down. But she also told me to grow up. i got to admit it burned a little when she said that. But I'm trying to take it to heart. And I guess growing up means... Putting what you should do in front of what you want to do, right? <laughs> you're asking me? I'm pretty sure you're older. Yeah, but I don't act like it, do I? You did with Durval. Now, don't give me too much credit. Part of me still wants to wait for a quiet moment and wring his neck. Yeah, but you won't. Because you're a good captain. Come on, stop. You're gonna make me tear up. So, after all this, yeah, what's so next what are you for gonna do Aaron now? Vanguardsman? Uh, heading back to the claim for a while. I'll get
get in touch with my clan and so the like this to rest main properly. Thread is gone. Like how she would have wanted. And by that I mean less chit chat, more drinking. What do you think the Osirim will do to Durval? First off, they'll argue about it for a long time. But whatever they come up with, it won't be quick. I can live with that. In fact, I might just drop by his cell under the sun ring to remind him what's coming. Okay. So he's under well, the sun ring. I know. He's probably gonna go. be sacrificed. Killers to track, Honestly, to master. that would be All awesome to breakfast. see. I would love to see a sacrifice happen. You know what? When we met, I thought I was a big shot talking to a pretty girl hidden away in the middle of nowhere. Now I see that I was just lucky to get a minute of your time. Try not to forget about me while you're out there changing the world. I'll always have a minute for you. Maybe even two. Two? Huh. <laughs> she likes me. Okay. So he is done being talked to. And now let's go talk to Duval, who's the optional one. But he's only optional because I... They say he's optional, but in all reality, I kind of want to talk to him and see why he did what he did. The Sun King lives, and there's no shadow covering the sun, as Duval said. Alright. Hello, good sir. Aloy, to say you have my gratitude feels woefully insufficient. You saved my life. You saved Meridian. And because of you, there will be justice for Ursa's murder. We can mourn her knowing the truth without painful uncertainty. It's hard to imagine where we'd be without you. And I don't want to try. I hope I you will stay as long as you Meridian. will have me. Were you and Ursa, you know? I suppose it's obvious how I feel. How I felt about her. She didn't just give me a. So advice. this is where we're gonna get the backstory. She gave me strength. But we couldn't be together. Relations between the Karja and Osaram and Meridian were unsteady as it was. The union of the Sun King and an Osirum warrior would have led to open revolt in the city. And probably war with the clans. Yeah. Anyone know? Only one. Derval. He wanted Ursa, but she rejected him. And so jealousy became yet another of his hateful motivations. Makes sense. What exactly will happen to Derval? He's gonna be sacrificed. For now, He'll languish in one of the old cells under the sun. Come on, he'll be sacrificed. I want to see a That's sacrifice. What after we negotiate his expedition to Mainspring, I don't want to think about it. My father was very creative when it came to inflicting suffering. But some Osiron devices surpass even his imaginings. What a waste. Derval is a brilliant man. I wonder what he would have accomplished if it weren't for my father's cruelty. Yeah. I know who attacked the Nora. A faction of Shadow Karja called the Eclipse. They're digging okay. up ancient machines. Weapons they want to use to strike Meridian. I see. What you're saying echoes whispers I've heard from Marad. A Shadow Karja splinter group. Corrupted machines across the land. When will the attack come, do you know? I'm not sure yet. And we will do what we can to prepare. Keep me informed if you learn more. Okay, so I will definitely keep you informed. Alright. So, that is now done. We are on to another main story quest. We got one left. Then we got the Ancient Armory side mission. So that's looking good. Let's see where this data point is. It's a book down here. Okay. And we have one skill point. Yep, just one. Alright. So where do we need to go for this one? 
Boom! Fuck Egypt. God. So we're fast traveling. I'm gonna try and sneak up on it. All gets this watcher. That's got their attention. Shit. Did I kill it? Is it dead? Did I kill it? I think I killed it. Nope! That thing is fully a lot. Full health. Why? Come on, buddy. Almost down. Almost down. Boom. Come on. You're down. Okay. And here come people. Yay, more people. Are you friendlies? Oh, you are not more people. You are watchers. Oh, no, you're grazers. Okay. I sh there's no reason to be scared of you. Okay, I'm s I'm safe. Okay, we're good. But where did I need to go? Up that way. Okay. All right, so time to go in this big ass thing and explore. Making sure I get all of these people. I think that's the only one that I did get. No, I got a wall. Oh. Wait, was that that guy? Yeah. I think that was that guy. Okay. I'm just gonna go right here. Alright. Alright, so I got an elite fucking beautiful. I know I'm here now. <laughs> Operation Enduring Victory. We've got company. Got him. Whatever it was, it doesn't seem to have turned out. That doesn't. Cool. Around the room. That could have gone horribly wrong if I mistimed that silent strike. That could have just been a freaking just wreck a Roni and pepperoni. Why can't I examine the I was able to like, examine the corpses? Let me examine, examine though. Maybe you were here? No. Okay.
Anything wrong? Oh, hi. Who are you? That seems like it's gonna be important. A stranded necklace. Why? I have no clue, but I'm picking it up because it looks like it's gonna be important for something. And I don't wanna have to backtrack. I'm actually kind of glad I was able to get those two guys killed and the Corrupted Watcher. So that way I didn't have to worry about having to fight them all off. What does this even say? Operation Enduring Victory. And this one? Same thing. Okay. Wee! Holy shit. Alright, there's something over there. Can I get down? Drop to ledge. I can't. Do I want to get down? Can I get up on that side? I don't know. This is all questions I must ask. Can I jump over to you? I can't. If over to you, would lead me to there. You know what? Fuck it. That worked. Alright. Perfect. Ha. Supply crate. Oh my gosh, so much shit. Perfect. Made it. I'll find a use for you. Alright, what are you? I don't know why, I have a feeling I'm going to have to come back to this place. I have a really weird feeling about this place that I'm going to have to come back to that for one reason or another. Must have been where the soldiers slept. Like Alright, well you know what? We will explore this place in the next episode. I'd like to thank you all for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to smack that like button down below, comment, and subscribe for more amazing content. And until next time, this has been your Spiteful Spartan, signing out. Stay frosty, everyone.